Alright, so this is Printer Jam 5, back again, learning more Luigi's Mansion. This is the third video, and in the last video, we started the second chapter after defeating the evil, evil Chauncey. And now we're gonna... Whoa there, that was really close. Alright, so we're gonna fight these guys. I don't remember what their name is. I wish I would knew. Um, I'm unfortunately going to record the majority of this game, actually, in one day for all you guys, so... The next few videos, you, pro you like you probably um, have been watching me play the last two videos here, uh, but unfortunately, I recorded the those two literally like this last hour or so, so I have not been able to upload one or anything else, and that's how it's going to be for a while. All right, so if you can see in the mirror, there's a button. By right, pressing the button, we're going to extend the wall, which is kind of weird. And what happens when we do that? We find a poster. And a weird wooden latch on the ground. So what we're going to do is we're going to come over here. We're going to suck the poster off the wall. And there's a button. By pressing the button, we open the latch. And what comes out but... Liquid nitrogen. More ghosts. Who there? Do there? To stir my sleep. It's the booze. Oh, whoa. No way. And the boos are all escaping, and we just made the game harder for ourselves. Whoa, what is that? Is that... King Boo? <gasps> no way. And we're getting more of a message from Egad. Are you okay? That was close. You need to come back. That was King Boo. Thanks for flushing him out, Luigi. I can find him now. So basically, Egad's been hunting the boos down for forever and a half. And he's not been able to find him, so Luigi just literally just found him all, all of a sudden. And by doing that, we were able to decide that we can go now catch the booze for Egad, because Egad was unable to. So that is another quest in this game. Now we're going to catch all 50 booze. There's 50 booze. 50 rooms in the game that are holding them. And there we go. There we go. With that. Not 50 rooms, I should say. But basically, there's 50 booze we need to catch. Okay, mm, got it clear. Yeah, is that clear? Is that clear? Okay then. All right. So where will you go, Luigi? We're gonna go back to the mansion. We're gonna start off with the very first stuff we began with, and we're gonna go and we're gonna catch some booze. Yeah. I'm gonna kind of work my way back though before I start. What's that lump in the table? Ew. 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 <laughs> Gross. Okay, so we're gonna come in here. Basically, the Game Boy Horror will now glow a different color, depending on how close you are. So, when you're clo really close to the Boo, you want to play Game Boo Advanced, there's our first Boo caught. You just have to simply sh uh, use your um, vacuum cleaner on it. You don't have to shine the light or anything on it. And Boos only come in the dark. Or, er, what am I saying? They only appear in the light, sorry. So you have to clear a room first, and then you can catch the boo in that room. So now we've caught one of 50 boos. And as you can see now, the Game Boo Horror. It's going to be called the Game Boo Horror. Now that we have the little blue light on it. The blue light indicates that there's not a boo in this room. The yellow one, shown here that's slowly blinking, shows that we, there is one. And as you slowly get closer to it, it starts blinking more and more until it gets red. You, you, you interact with it. Looking for me, Bootha. And they can go into other rooms, by the way. I should I should mention that right now. There's gonna be some booze that will literally make you chase after them halfway across the mansion. It's really annoying. And if they go into a room that you have not yet explored, good luck getting them. <laughs> um, the best thing to do at that point would be to reset your game. I am Bamboo, if you please. The best thing to do at that point is just to reset your game and just. Deal with them later. I almost missed him. That would have been really annoying. Get that one gold bar. No. I better not lose that gold bar because of the stupid game. Okay, thank you. Alright. So now I've caught three boos already. Look at that. We're amazing. We're the best video game players ever. So we can come over here now. As you can see, the, the rooms are all lit up now. Even the hallway here. Let's see here. Ooh. Found him. Speak now of my name. Taboo. I am Taboo, looking to cause to horror on you. Is he still in the room? Did I miss him? Did I lose him? Oh, I just went in the other room. Okay, so this is what happens when you lose him. 
if you go quickly enough across the room, and get in there, he'll just be in the center of the room like so, and you can just quickly continue catching him, um, which is not that hard. Alright, which actually kind of made it easier for us, because now we can just continue on and get the next one in here. Okay. Be careful, Luigi. I want to get some of this money, too. Like, the only reason we lost that boost is because I wanted that money. Um, I feel I've shown you in some places where a lot of stuff is. So I don't feel totally obligated. Oh, yeah, by the way, sometimes bombs can drop out. And things called boo bomb. Boo, boo, blah, 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 blah. Bullicious. Ooh, bullicious. Ooh. Anyway. Um, a boo ball can fall out, too, and that's basically like the balls we shot at Chauncey. It's just a little round ball that you pick up with your vacuum cleaner and you shoot at him. Alright, we found five boos already. Quite <laughs> quite a bit of work. We've, it's only been five minutes, we've already caught ten of the boos in the game. It's pretty awesome. And we're going to catch one more in Chauncey's room. Actually, we can catch a few more still, I, sh I should have said. Um, pfft, let's see, where is he? Oh, I uh, fell the second ago. See here? Yeah! Turbo! And each boo will have varying lengths of health, by the way. The first one we caught was varying between 30 and 50. Actually, all these guys have caught, uh, have been between 30 and 50. But the boos can literally go up as high as 300 for each boo, and it's pretty crazy eventually. <laughs> but for now, we've caught six boos, and that's pretty okay for now. Alright, so one more thing we want to continue doing. I'm gonna go back over here I'm gonna go over here I'm gonna go catch I believe two more booze well yeah two more booze so we're gonna go and we're gonna go back in here let's try to get okay that's a heart and what's in here anything in my mind hearts okay well we're gonna come right back in a second and get that one and usually the boo in this room is in one of these crates which go ahead and prove me a liar he wasn't in one Oh, yes, he was. See, that's a boo ball. That's a boo ball right there. You can pick it up and shoot it. All right. Um, he's probably still going to be in the crates, yeah. There we go. And just call me Game Boo. <laughs> You're going to go back down that little latch thingy. Okay, Mr. The Boo Guy. Fantastic. Way to go, Luigi. Now, send me that boo and all the data you got. All right. Be careful, Luigi. Alright, so now we're gonna go back over here. Oh, I like how the chandelier is still shaking. And there's that boo. There we go, 60 health on this one. Now that we're in area 2, I guess they decided just like, oh, well, we've given, we've given them 5 boos so far. Let's, let's make them have a little more health. Okay, yes, I'm loving your brilliant inventions, Egad. Alright, so now that we've caught 8 boos, we've already gotten like a fifth of the game right there. Alright, these guys, I should. Oh, oh boy, a lot of new ghosts. Um, okay, so in the last video we, we encountered a white ghost that hung from, the, hung from the ceiling. That ghost had zero health. Hello, Mr. Portrait Ghost. That ghost had zero health, and you could just suck him up right away. Okay, this room doesn't have any boost. We can come over here now, I believe. There we go. <laughs> we got a key. So basically, he just sticks from the wall, and he's supposed to surprise you and attack you, basically, if he hits you. They're pretty weak ones. Um, don't worry about it. You, you, you drop the key in the toilet, but I'll still use it anyway. So that's that. Um, and then the purple ones that we just saw there the, are their counterparts. They drop bombs, and they also have zero health. So they're still not that much of a danger. But the thing is, catching ghosts with zero health are actually sometimes harder than catching ghosts with health. It's kind of weird. And then these, go the yellow ghost that will appear now, maybe? Oh, okay. or, or not. Don't appear at all now. There's also another ghost I want to try and catch. Um, sometimes if you go by here, there's a yellow mouse that can appear. And if you get the yellow mouse, you get a quite a sum of money. There's that white guy. One purpley white guy. Okay, we're gonna skip this room completely. And we're gonna go in here. Alright, so this has an interesting gimmick. We're not gonna be able to see these guys, but we can see him in the reflection. 
but we could not see him otherwise. So as you can see, we're gonna we're facing our reflection, and you can't see the one that's right in front of us, but we can see him in the reflection. It's kind of weird, like a vampire ghost almost. These guys are pretty simple though, still. And oh shoot! There we go. Catch two of them at once. All right. Come on, I'm gonna lose this one, I think. Oh, or not. And I think this time I'm gonna fight three of them at once. Come on, no, 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 no. Okay, at least I got rid of them. I just don't want them doing damage to me. Alright, and I think that's it. There we go. Alright, now this is gonna give us a really cool item, actually. And it is a red medallion. So basically, what the red medallion is, is going to give us the power of fire elemental. So now when we um, come across certain objects, such as a flaming torch or so, we can actually catch a fire elemental ghost, and we can spit fire out of our vacuum, which doesn't make any sense. It would, like, burn the vacuum cleaner and, and like, completely. But anyway, so we're going to... Come on. Yeah, okay. Now there is a boo that we want to catch. It's always a boo ball. I always catch the boo ball first in this in this room. It's annoying. But anyway, that's a fire elemental right there. Is he in the same room? What is this? Come on. Oh, is it the chandelier? What is this? Okay, there we go. Anyway, we caught... We accidentally caught one of the fire elemental ghosts, so we'll go ahead and just... Uh, you press the L button and you shoot fire. Okay? We're gonna catch that ghost real quickly, though. And that will unlock the room, and let's catch that stupid bugger. Come on. No! Don't get stuck on that! No! Bad! Ugh. By the way, I should mention that these ghosts are actually... Lot weaker, or a lot stronger, I should say, in the dark. Whoa! I never saw that before. He was like broken glitch. Great. So now we lost one of the boos. That's perfect. Um, we can literally find him later on in the, in the again if we were so lucky. Ooh, there's a boo hidden in here. Oh, there he is. Yes, get him. I had hopes that he was in here. There we go, we caught him. <laughs> There's that one. Alright, so we've gotten nine boos so far. We're doing really awesome, actually. Um, oh, wait, there's actually another thing we can do in here. I'm gonna quickly grab that and that. Uh, we'll ignore this fortune teller's room, by the way. We'll get something in a minute from it. Or, not in a minute, but we'll get something soon from it. Oh, there we go. And then we'll make the key appear by writing everything there. And there we go. Now we'll open up that room. And that's where we're going to go next. Okay. Alright. There. Caught him. <laughs> Stupid annoying guy. I don't know how to make that one yellow mouse activate ever. It's kind of weird. And do 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 do. Okay, so this is what we want to do next. We want to turn... We ran out of fire. Beautiful. Sometimes fire elemental ghosts can even be in these candles here. So I was kind of hoping I would have one there. Darn it. Come on, there needs to be a fire elemental. Come on. Ugh. I need to go all the way back. Well, I guess that cuts it for this then uh, video then. So thank you guys for watching. I hate those guys. This has been Bitter Jam 5 playing Luigi's Mansion Part 3 for the Nin Stars. See you guys next time with Part 4, where we go and find out what those mysterious candles are up to. Bye, guys.